Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel, JT Open Stuff. And as you can see from the thumbnail, we are on part four of our Galactus Build-A-Figure build. So we got all seven of this Build-A-Figure series from 2005 Toy Biz Marvel Legends. And today we are going to be opening up Deathlock. So you can see right there, Deathlock is a really cool looking figure in here. You will also get a comic book inside. And Deathlock has 39 points of articulation. So I've been building these up over the last few months, just buying them at toy stores and eBay and such. But as you can see on here, Deathlock's intelligence is off the charts, a six. His fighting skills are a six as well, which compared to our last video that we opened, Nightcrawler, Nightcrawler was a three in both of those. So Deathlock, pretty powerful figure, at least, you know, in this Marvel Legends series. But our ultimate goal is to build this guy right here. So we're going to get in that today. I did want to show you this, though, because Deathlock, let's see, oh, I cannot find it right now, guys. Sorry about that. I was going to show you a little side um, photo I had of that, but Deathlock is definitely going to be one of the figures that, you know, I think is going to be really cool looking in the collection. This shiny red almost has a little Iron Man look to it, but we're going to jump right into this. We're going to take our grandpa knife. We're going to jump into this package and cut away from ourselves. All right, guys, here we go. Let's pop this open. Take that right out of there and get our comic book out. And there you go. You can see right there, this was a reprint of, bo of book three of four of Deathlock. So very neat that you get a comic in this as well. And then you do get the instructions on how to build Galactus if you can't figure that out. We're going to put that right over on the side. And we're going to get right into this. So there you can see we got the torso of Galactus today, which is very, very, it makes these packages really hefty. Just this piece alone um, probably weighs as much as the Deathlock figure by itself. So let's turn that around. We're going to get all of these little twist ties undone here. We're going to see if we can get this done in under a minute. What do you say? I don't know if you guys started a timer. I did not, but I'm going to try my best to get it done in under one minute. And while I'm doing that, I'm just going to tell you guys how much I really appreciate all of you guys who have subscribed. I really, really appreciate it. Um, just under 900 subscribers at the filming of this video. And I, I just wanted to say thank you so much to everyone that has subscribed. And if you haven't already, please don't hesitate to do so like opening up toy videos or toys of all kind and doing videos for you guys. So thank you so much. If you haven't watched my Toys for Tots video, I'd really, really appreciate you watching that as well. Um, something really important to me this time of year it means a whole, whole heck of a lot to me that you guys are joining me today. So thank you so much. And look at that. I almost had them all done in the time that it took me to say all that. So these are all done. Let's turn it around. I'm going to take this Galactus piece out. And now let's take Deathlock out. Oh, I did miss one, guys. Sorry about that. Let's take that apart really quickly there. There we go. Now we're out those out of the way over there. Now this guy has a nice long hose on his weapon. So tons of articulation as you can see here. Absolute tons of articulation. What's interesting is some of these figures because they have realistically this these figures have sat in their packages at this point for 13 years? No, what, what am I? 18 years. Every time I try to figure that out, guys, my math, I think, gets worse and worse there. So 18 years 
for some of these figures to have sat in packages. And I know some of them probably were not kept in the best conditions, but you know, all in all, the ones that I've opened up so far, pretty decent condition. And I've really, really enjoyed opening them. So as you can see here, Deathlock has a really, really mean looking face sculpt there. Not somebody that you would want to mess with at all. This weapon there. I'm trying to figure, this does turn like this, so you would think, there we go. And does that go down any there? Okay. So now we can get his arm in a little bit more normal, normal pose there. But very cool. I do like it very much. Coming right at you. The colors are really vibrant still on this figure. I love these old Toy Biz figures. I just like the articulation. I think that the, the sculpts were re really cool. Um, they don't feel as, I don't know, brittle? I don't know if that's a good word for it, but they feel a little more substantial when you're opening them up. So, so far we've opened up that Deathlock, that Nightcrawler. Okay guys, I'm back here in a show that I am a super professional YouTuber, not. I actually sat down to record this series and apparently didn't realize that my phone was not charged. So just shut me off there in the middle of talking to you guys, but hey, I appreciate you, appreciate you dealing with this. Um, what I was trying to show you before my phone caught off on me is that we've opened the Deathlock, we've opened Nightcrawler, we've opened Bullseye, And we've opened War Machine. All four of these figures, I think, stand the test of time. They look just as good as any figures that are being put out today. Um, I like each and every one of them very, very much. But for right now, we're going to put them over on the side. And we're going to take a look at this torso. Now, this torso is massive. And when you add it to the 10-inch tall Galactus that we've already started building... It is going to be pretty impressive. So without any delay, let's go ahead and try to... Whoa. So that did pop right in there. And look at that. It moves back and forth. It does have some articulation. And now we are talking a really large figure. Back that up a little bit for you guys. And you can see right now, we are at about 12 inches of figure so far and still going. So this is looking awesome. I am super, super excited about it. Um, Thank you guys so much for watching today's video. I really appreciate it. Join me for the next video where I'm going to be opening up my favorite Doctor Strange figure of all time. That's right. This is it. If you disagree, tell me which line has your favorite Doctor Strange figure in the comments down below. But this is on the next video. Thank you so much for watching today's video. My name is JT. I appreciate it. I'll talk to you next time. Bye.